Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. In the last episode we finished up walking through Burmica. We got all equipped and ready. Uh, you can check the last video and check what equipment we had. I'm also going to put some in the description below. Is a video of the, the, the equipment and abilities that we had equipped for this next boss fight. And thank you for joining us. Really, I appreciate it. And remember, anything you guys can do to like, comment, or subscribe is going to help me greatly. Anyways, on to the game. Freya, I'm sorry, but from the looks of this, I don't think the king made it. Choose to leave her alone. And it kind of hurries up everything. Anything else, and she won't take off like that right away. There's someone inside the palace. What are you waiting for? Get up here. Uh, girl, I don't know if you, if you like, want to know this or anything, but, but, uh, listen, listen up. Listen. Um, yeah. Yeah, we can't jump up there that easily. And Quinn and Vivi most definitely cannot. <laughs> right on his face. Right on his face. What a little baby. Baby poo poo. Baby poo poo pants. Baby poo 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 cha poo cha pants. Who is that? I knew she was behind all this. What do you mean, you knew? I decided to return to Burmica because I heard rumors that Bran had set her sights on our kingdom. Then that girl standing next to her must be Beatrix, Alexandria's general. That's Beatrix? The cold-blooded knight who knows no mercy? Beatrix. Flashback! Beatrix. Yes, Beatrix. I hear there are many fierce warriors out in the world. Some more powerful than even I. Beatrix, of Alexandria in particular. They say her swordsmanship is the best in the land. Sir Fratley, do you still insist on going on your journey? Yes. Please understand, Freya. Right now, Burmica is at peace, while other nations are slowly but surely gaining power. I don't know if my spear alone is enough to protect Burmica, which is precisely why I must go out into the world. Sir Fratley... I don't think I can live on my own, not without you. Freya, you're going to be fine. Trust your strength, and have faith in your destiny. Once I complete my journey around the world, I will return to Burmica. Then promise me one more time that you will return. I promise. Fratley, you never came back. You've left me with nothing except rumors of your death. I couldn't believe it. I still won't believe it. Never. Not until I witness proof of your death with my own eyes. And I will travel across the world forever if I must. Are you alright? Yes. I was just thinking about the past. You still can't get over him, huh? Who is that? Who is that indeed? You guys are going to laugh at me, but my favorite character in any video game ever is who that is. I find this rain quite pleasant. It feels as though the raindrops are blessing our victory. Kuja? We must take care of him once and for all and prevent these rats from ever rising up again. Beatrix, what's taking so long? You're wasting your time. Rats often look for new homes when they sense an earthquake. They probably moved to the sandy treehouse by now. So you see, it's too late. The king has already turned tail and fled. Sandy treehouse? Surely you don't mean Clara. It'll be quite difficult. <laughs> Clara. Unless we can get through that standstorm, it will be impossible to attack them. Kuja, what do you think? Surely, with your powers, there must be something you can do. Of course, your majesty. 
I will present you a marvelous display of my power. I am certain that you will be most pleased. I was wondering if you would gather your troops near Clara. I'm certain those filthy rats will retaliate in full force, and my black mages may not be enough. I made him sound way too masculine, I think. Sounds like we got trouble. That sinister man, who is he? Beats me. I've never seen him before. Well, it sounds like they're going to Clara. I don't know either. Clara has remained in isolation for a hundred years. If my people escape to there, they'll be safe, at least for a while. What's this place like? The people of Clara are originally from Burmica. Long ago, they severed ties with Burmica over a trivial conflict. Now the kingdom is at peace, shielded by a large sandstorm. One we saw earlier. What is he thinking? And there we go. Jumping in to save the day, because we're heroes. And that's what heroes do. Burmica will never fall. Prepare to die. You wish to fight me, Beatrix of Alexandria? I commend your courage, but I shall show you no mercy. Hold it. You'll have to deal with us first. <laughs> I've never been so humiliated in my life. I once killed a hundred knights single-handedly. To me, you two are nothing more than insects. Here we go, guys. We're fighting the acclaimed, the strongest, the general of Alexandria. Perhaps the most skilled warrior in the entire world. Right here, right now. We got this, guys. Make sure you steal from her. She's got some awesome stuff. And let's also see if... Oh, where is... Mighty Guard, we can't cast it yet. But one day, one day. Angel Snacks, use remedies on all. Magic Hammer, what do we want to use? We're just going to attack. Alright, so we stole a Phoenix down, not a big deal. Make sure you jump. And of course, uh, I messed up there. You should actually cast Slow instead of Lazara. How'd that feel, Beatrix? Yeah, that's going to kill you no matter what, guys. Okay, so we stole a chain plate and a phoenix down. That's great and all, but we need to do more than that. We need to be doing some more damage. Um, now, we, we want to steal a mithril sword is, is the next thing we want to steal from, from her. Hopefully we can get that in this try. Um, you know, if not... Oh, I'm... Oh, why do I keep forgetting to cast slow? Do you guys want to see Limit Glove? <laughs> I'll show you guys Limit Glove in a second. Let's, let's make sure that we can steal this first. Here's Reese's Wind. I'll show you guys Reese, Reese's Wind first. Uh, no. Alright, I'm gonna heal Quinna first. Alright, steal... Okay, as long as Quinta doesn't die, I can show you guys, um, we need to, come on, we need to keep this going. Alright, I don't want Limit Glove yet. Uh, alright, well, I'll show you guys Reese's win. Oh, Zidane's taking the attack. No, Zidane, I needed you, man. This casts Reagan on all party members, which is awesome, guys. Awesome, awesome stuff. Oh, that was dumb. I'm sorry, guys. This fight has gone so poorly. So poorly. I am so dumb. That is the second mistake I have made in this stupid video. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. Don't do anything that I have done except for steal. Um, everything else, just cast slow immediately. You want to make sure she's not putting out damn, that much damage. Um, and just... Oh, 
I didn't have a chance to do it yet. No, no big. So we didn't get the Mithril Sword. Don't worry. We'll, we'll get it. We'll get it elsewhere. Not a big deal. But anyways, she has 3,630 health. Uh, and you can steal a Phoenix down a chain plate or a Mithril Sword. Or you can just stay alive long enough for her to kill you. How ridiculously weak. Isn't there anyone who is worthy of facing me? So they're going to attack Clara. Now what do we have here? Another filthy rat and... Hmm. This boy could become a problem. Yeah. Yeah, enjoy this. Enjoy this video, guys. Yes, you want to save your game. How awesome was that? Oh, and by the way, yes, he was completely, completely wearing a thong. He was most definitely wearing a thong. So, so there's that. And we have just completed disc one. Can you believe that? Already, it's only been like 40 episodes and we have finally completed disc one. That was awesome, guys. I had a really good time. And of course, we'll be continuing on to Disc 2 next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX right here at Mistledyne Online. And again, if you guys are liking what you're seeing, please like, comment, and subscribe. It helps me tremendously. See you next time.